The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Number seven, today in the 13 phobia countdown for Scarehouse TV, I'm Aaron Kleiber. Hi. Creeping and crawling. We're talking about the fear of spiders, bugs, and snakes. First, the fear of spiders, arachnophobia, one of the only phobias we know because of a John Goodman movie. In Uruguay, you can get spiders on your Big Mac at McDonald's. Not sure if you, it's a 40 cent up charge, so I don't know if it's worth it. And there's the idea that they are kind of taking over our body when we're asleep, if they're crawling into our ears, crawling into our nose, into our mouth, which they don't think is, is happening as much as kind of the mass public seems to think. The idea that they can, that earwigs can actually crawl into our ears, it's just profoundly unsettling. Oh, I don't know how to say that. The phyodophobia. It is the fear of snakes. Some people just see snakes and they're just, uh, 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 they can't handle, uh, they can't handle snakes. So they have found that people, you know, who have grown up in remote northern places, who have never seen a snake, who have no ancestors who probably were raised around snakes, and they still fear snakes. And so this gave rise to this idea called snake detection theory, which basically suggests that we are hardwired to fear specifically snakes. What is more likely is that snakes have characteristics which are inherently terrifying. That's it for this week. Next week, the doctor is in. Ding, please sign in. I'm Aaron Kleiber. Follow your heart. Funny stuff, podcasts, videos, stand-up comedy cooking. If you want to see any more fun, creepy, scary videos, go to scarehouse.tv and also go to scarehouse.com to find out about one of the best haunts in America, the Scarehouse. The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain and the itsy bitsy spider climbed in your ear and laid some eggs and laid some eggs and then three years later all the spiders hatched and came out in your bed and attacked your children and then your children had spider eggs under their skin and then you were a video on Facebook where all the spiders came out <laughs>